Tonight, the family of the Walmart worker who died of the coronavirus tells WBZ she was an amazing mom and a very hard worker, and they are upset with Walmart. They believe the company didn't do enough to keep workers safe. As Katie Brace shows us, the family is now in mourning and looking for answers. I just think she deserved better. Um, she was like such a great woman. Yo Kian Lee lived an active life for 69 years until she contracted coronavirus. She's selfless. Um, she was a great mother, great grandmother. Elaine Eklund is her daughter. My mom is like the sweetest, um, kindest woman you'll ever meet. She's very funny. She loves to laugh. Um, she she loved her job for 15 to 20 years that job was at the quincy walmart where recently she was one of 11 employees to test positive for the virus on sunday she died from it on monday the day after yok yan lee passed away the quincy walmart temporarily shut down the health department said they were already monitoring the store and working with them on crowd control and social distancing she had expressed concern to her friends um not to me because she probably didn't want me to worry elaine says her mom was healthy babysitting her two grandchildren and taking zumba every day Two weeks ago, she became ill at work. They said that she like started showing symptoms the day before, and they didn't. They never called me. The next day, Elaine could not get in touch with her. First responders had to break down the door and rush her to the hospital, barely breathing. If I didn't follow up on her, like I did that day, she would have passed away by herself in her apartment. The last time Elaine saw Yok Yan Lee conscious was through the glass at the emergency room. I never got to say goodbye because. She was never, she wasn't awake. This is the final photo Elaine has with her mom, taken a few hours before her death, hand in hand, one covered in PPE. In Quincy, Katie Brace, WBZ News.